Zombie Apocalypse. <laughs> What is going on everybody it's flawless welcome to a brand new overwatch noob guide video and today it's going to be soldier 76 now let's get right into it so his main weapon is the heavy pulse rifle it does between 6 to 19 damage and does around 9 rounds per second 25 ammo and 1.5 seconds of reload time so you could say this weapon is pretty decent and especially against supports it does very well against tanks it doesn't do very well that's kind of the counter to him and so he's not really that that overpowered but against really weaker units with lower health pools he can definitely wreck them it does a lot of damage especially if you use the helix rockets which is the second ability and basically if you get a direct hit with this it will do 120 damage 80 damage if it's splash and 40 damage if you shoot it to the ground I guess and you blow yourself up it does 40 damage to yourself and overall this does pretty well and it's got only an 8 second cooldown time so this for taking out shields of Bastion, Orisa, maybe um, Winston so anybody that has a shield this is very good for it especially because it's just a direct 120 and then you could pair that up with your weapon damage and you'll see that you'll take out targets very very fast especially if they're non non tanky if they're tanky characters then you're not going to take them out as fast and one of the great things about soldier as well is that he could sprint now a lot of heroes in this game struggle with this not really a lot but there's a few that they don't really have any ability to sprint or to just move faster some people are just very slow especially the tanks a lot of them are just very slow and it takes you a very long time to get from the spawn to the objective especially if your team has pushed forward and if you don't have a Lucio on your team to give you that speed boost, then you definitely need this. So this is why Soldier is really good as well. And he also has his own self-healing. So this is a pretty basic healing. It does 40.8 health per second. That's what it heals. And then over the entire length of it, it will do 204 health. It will regen that. So the cooldown is 15 seconds. And so basically across the span of five seconds you're gonna get 204 health so overall this is very good and this could heal your entire team as well your players could actually get in that healing and they will get the effects as well which is very good and it's offensively very very good if your team is just weak and everybody just gets together into that healing especially the really really lackey supports they could get inside that and then there's the ultimate ability, which is the tactical visor. This is pretty much an aimbot. Basically, the reload time, because there is a reload. Once you burn through all the ammo after you aimed at a target, it will be 0.75, so it's much faster. And this alt pretty much lasts 6 seconds. But pretty much he auto-locks into any enemies that's closest to him. And he'll just start... You gotta press the fire button, obviously. But you can just start firing at them and you won't miss a bullet. And this is really good, especially when the other team, a lot of them are very weak after like a consecutive fight and you activate this, you're going to like one shot everybody because you're not going to miss a bullet, especially if you pair this up with your other abilities like the helix rockets, you're going to do a lot, a lot, a lot of damage. This is why I think Soldier 76 is one of the best characters in the game in my opinion. I don't know if he has seen much pro play. I haven't been focused too much on the pro aspect of Overwatch. Been busy with other videos. But hopefully you guys did enjoy this noob guide. I'll be creating the Master Series very, very soon. I just need to get ahead with this series first. And then I'll begin the Mastering Series as well. If you guys did enjoy the video, like would be much appreciated. Please guys, take a few minutes to check the description below. You guys can see there's my PayPal if you guys wish to donate anything to the channel. Anything will help as small as you guys think it is. It is going to help me out in the long run. And there's my Patreon if you guys want to help me out in the long run. And you guys will get some cool rewards. Let me know what you think. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.